was eight and fourteen. So go to the end of a. I think it's the end of the. Oh, is that what we're supposed to do? I don't know. I just. So we got. We have three on our team. We have five teams. We have four. We have four. Okay, so yeah, everyone will probably just get in one section of the X. Where do we need to be? Sandwich. What's that? Where do we need to be? We're going to have. A group here, 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 and here. So it's in between the rows. So yeah. Same. Four, four groups. So well, I need to, I need to switch them. Why you guys, you three split up into one or the other. Strong guys. Yeah, so we kind of want to split up the guys and equally into the groups. Okay, you guys have five. We have three. You guys have five. They have three. Then you have four. So what do we go? Well, yeah, we can have four. I'll, I'll trace with one of you guys. So. Well, then they're going to have two guys, so... Oh, sorry. Okay. Yep. Alright. Okay, this looks good. Alright. So, what the name of the game is, is a four-way tug of war. Okay? The rules of the game are basic, just the same as regular tug of war, except you need to pull the knot, or the center of this, over your line. Okay? <laughs> Now, since I need everyone's attention, I need everyone's attention real quick. We are in limited space, so be careful. Maybe cost you don't like fall and hit a wall or something. But you do want to get this part of the rope over your line. Okay. So, you guys ready? Everybody ready? On your mark, get set, go!
Yes. No, no, no. No, because you don't want to be the one calling Yeah. And again, yeah, well, this is what we're going to do. We're going to, like, make it taunt, but I'm going to move it here to the center as best I can. And then you guys are going to, I'll say go, all right? Does everyone have, everyone taunt? Not yet, not yet. Everybody taunt? <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm ready. All right, ready? On your mark, get set, go! Strategies one by one. What was your guys' strategy? Yeah. Cool, this way. Okay. How about you guys? Our strategy was just try to walk backwards, but that didn't work. And I had I had, I had tied it, and I just was leaning as far back as I could. I sat on the road. I did, I sat down too because I was leaning so far back, but there was no way. We tried a counting strategy. Uh -huh. One, two, three, pull. Good. Very good. Well, how, about, how about you guys? We scooted up on the ropes. We had more room to yeah. go backwards. We ran out of room. Very easy. Yeah. 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 And then I realized, like halfway through it, that there were times when it like gave a little bit. You know, it was like that wave, and it gave. So she looked back. She's like, "When they're weak, you know." So when I thought we were just like, we gave everything that we had. Like yep. when they're too weak, we pull. Right. Yeah. So what was what was the difference in between, like from this tug of war to basic tug of war, where it's just two teams? Still? Times. And how, like how you guys said, when you found like there are actually times when they're weaker, how could you use that to your advantage? Advantage. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know about being weaker, down. but I noticed the first time, because I was just looking at the wall the second time, but the first time I noticed that team was like super close to winning, mm -hmm. and so we kind of slid over here and used their strength there you go. <laughs> with ours to get it further back to the middle, and then over to us, and then we won. <laughs> so it wasn't just a single team effort, but it's in that essence, it's both of you guys working against them. Very good. Um, yeah, how could uh, how could we apply that to our lives now? Like that that principle right there. Your friends close and your enemies close. <laughs> well, I, I mean, I think in the real sense that we think that all of these people were pulling against them and you don't really get anywhere and if you're doing a tug of war with your family like let's say this is a family and you have brothers sisters uh, husbands and wives on all four corners you're going to have a lot of trouble and i guess you could think about trying to eliminate the tug of wars in your life by good communication and understanding if you come together you don't need to struggle as much times in our lives when when things will be <clears throat> going really well and, and times when there's more conflict and the whole your whole life ebbs and it flows. But if you take advantage of those moments you'll get a lot further that you have. Thank you guys. Um, that's our activities four way